Hey, this is Gods Patch League Channel, so I'm just going to do a quick video, it's really quick, not that long, um, video on using a notepad or a text document um, to make a log file. Basically what this does is every time you open up the log file, it shows you whoops, um, the time and the date when it was opened. Um, I'll show you how to make this in a second, I'm just going to quickly tell you, um, it only, and then when you exit you have to save it and then it will keep the last record of your time then you'll exit and you save it again um, you can add um, a code at the bottom I can't remember how you do it what you can do is you can add the code right at the bottom of um, this word document so it will basically the moment it opens it will automatically save and close itself but I can't remember the code on how to do that so if I find out how to do it I'll post a new video and I'll also put the link to the new video in the description of this one um, this is really good if you have a computer what hasn't got a clock in the top right hand corner. Um, I can't think of the operating system. It's probably like the really old fashioned grey one, Windows 2000 or something like that. Um, what well, probably won't have a clock. Um, in my school, there's um, really old fashioned, well, some computers are quite new. Um, but there's computers, yeah, are new, but they just don't have the clock on them for some reason. So checking the time, knowing when school's going to end, you know. Um, lessons gonna end. It's quite annoying, especially if you've got like a watch and my phone's broken, so it's quite annoying. Um, and if stuff like that, if you don't have the time on you, this is the best way to find out. You can make it this in school anywhere. Um, it's quite simple and easy to make. I'm just gonna pop that up there. What you do is you right click, go new, and go text document. If not, you can just go to Start Menu and find Notepads, like so. What you do is you basically type dot, then log has to all be in capitals, otherwise it won't work. So you type that in. What you do now is you go save it, um, whatever you like. Um, call it dot log in caps dot text for text document, um, and save it. I've already got one. So, do you want to replace it? Well, I'm going to replace it. Okay. Um, save that. Um, now, if I open up this, if you notice, 11.53, it's the 7th, of the, um, 3rd of the 7th, 2011. On the 7th of the 7th, you're about to get Blue Flame on Halo Reach. I'll be making a video about that soon. Um, and this is really cool um, to keep track of time. Um, as I said, I'll post up the update if I can if I can remember what code you type in at the bottom to automatically save and close straight away. Um, you can also um, change the icon of this, and you, I'm not sure if you can rename it or not, but I know you can change the icon. Um, I think you can get rid of a name somehow. There's like a glitch that like make the name invisible, so you can um, so you can't see the text. So when people click on it. You can see how many times people use the Internet Explorer or certain programs on your computer, um, and where it lost my clothes and stuff like that. If I can find the other video, it will save it, and then you can see how many times people have been on the internet in one day. If you're doing a survey or anything like that. Okay, this has been Scott's Pat Sleep Channel, and see ya.